Okay, this is the silky ear. Basically, what you're going to do is you're going to take it down to the skull on the inside. And you can also take out a little bit of this triangle in here. It'll just stick out. And on the outside, where this fold is in the ear, you're going to leave this hair. But you can take it, you can take part of the bell down, or you can go on a bit of an angle and all the way up. Well, you'll see once it's done what hair gets left. So I'm just going to put my, e my fingers on the inside of the ear to make sure I poke out anything that folds so I don't clip anything. And then I'm just going to go straight up, put my finger there to hold the ear flap, straight out. Sarah, good girl. Okay, now that fold is about right where my finger is, so I'm going to take off stuff above it, but I'm going to leave everything below that fold. <laughs> Sarah. I'm going to pull it up a little bit. If you need to wet your finger to make things stay down, that's okay. Get this really long stuff out of the way. I'm going to pull it out and taut a little bit, so I... Don't get caught up in her long hair. I'm just going to shave up. I'm going to shave this way to the edge. And there's other stuff that's long. I'll catch when we do the inside. Now I leave, I don't take her bell right down. I leave a little bit. There's a little bit sticking out there, which I can catch. But you're just going to go with the grain of the hair and catch this little triangle in here a little bit from the back. We'll catch the rest from the front. So it's not a Yorkie ear. You don't leave it halfway up. You take it down further. All the way around. Leave everything from the fold on the outside edge alone. You can take a little bit of this off or you can do it with the thinning scissors after if you want. Depends on the shape of your dog's ear and the ear set. Okay, now I'll pause and go around to the front. Okay, press play. And play. Okay, so what I do here is I take the long stuff and I part it on the ear. And there again, you've got a little fold here, so I'm going to stick my finger through from the back. And I'm going to just carefully go up straight up to the edge, all the way around. Same with the inside edge or the inside of the outside edge. Being careful not to go down past that fold in the ear right here. Now you see all this little sticky up hair here? This long stuff will cover it. So what you can do, again, depending on your dog's ear set, you're gonna to wanna to come in and just take that down, just scoop a little bit at a time and take a look. You may not have to do that if your dog has a really nice, tight, upright ear set. You may not do that as much. You may just want to, you know, trim off what sticks out. See this little part sticking out here? I'm going to put my finger through there and I'm just going to scoop it out from the back. She has a little bit wider ear set, so I take that down. On my nails without the wide ear set, I may just trim up what sticks out and that's it. Okay. Now anything that sticks out a little bit, hair off your fingers, wet your fingers and just pull it out like that so it sticks out. Then you can take a small pair of scissors and you can trim the edges off. Don't trim flat, put out a little bit of a curve so you don't nick the edge of the ear. I'm not going to do a lot of this because my eyesight is... Uh, crappy for doing this, so I tried to do most of it with the clippers. So there, that's the ear. Things sticking from the fold down is left. This little piece right here could be taken. And everything else is taken down in the front, inside, and outside. Stop.